Okay, Corey, we forgot. We forgot. This is not episode 15. This is episode, episode 14.5. 14. 14. A little halfsy in there for those that right. can't get enough of the twins. <laughs> okay. um, but we forgot two things, and we discussed it at lunch. Um, we were eating, it's what, two two for two Oh, um, two cheese. I think it's a national chain, but it's a pizza, pizza place. I thought pizza place. <laughs> had to get my typo. That's right. It's a pizza place that on Tuesdays has two for one pizzas, and Corey's got a giant husband who will eat... All the leftovers and an entire pizza, entire good, good night. lord. He will eat the whole pizza when I get home. So we try to go think of him on Tuesdays and get the two for one so he can eat. But while we were eating, we noticed that we forgot two things, and I wanted to talk about the mailbag because we actually got an amazing thing in the mail. Oh, what? You just have so many accents. <laughs> Okay, if you would stop staring at the little I can just see things. the little things hitting the tippy toppy saying, Okay, guys, she keeps backing me away here. Eventually, I think you're dead. I'm just going to be in another room when she's talking about herself. Oh, fine. The podcast I've always wanted. <laughs> so Greg actually sent us something in the mailbag, and it was this peanut butter delicious gooeyness. Um, and word has it that he is actually going to be able to ship nationwide soon. Greg, oh. correct me if I'm wrong. You can shoot me later if I... Wait, is there a podcast? Greg, there's a podcast. <laughs> um, but I want to actually thank Greg. That was super thoughtful. And pictures to come because you know I'm extra like that. So you can see what you missed out on and maybe even order it yourself now that Greg's shipping. Yeah, it's a uh, flash frozen and sent to you. That's what it said. I know. So it was like arrived perfectly. I was so impressed. Oh, it made me feel like um, a celebrity. Ah. So if you want to send something into our mailbag, it can be anything. Don't let size to write, it, write me a card, you know. Give Heather a little cardy card. Just a little cardy card. Where can they send that to? 15,000 Potomac Town Place, Suite 245, Woodbridge, Virginia, 22191. Say that slowly so everyone hears. Fifth. 15,000 Potomac Town Place, Suite 245, Woodbridge, Virginia, 22191. You know what happened? And uh, one of the group member- members was like, I accidentally hit a button on my phone, but you guys were talking so fast that it was like so frustrating. I kept having to rewind it. <laughs> And she's like, I could not audibly understand what you guys are saying. Neither can I. But her husband comes home and she says, you know, I can't understand them. And he puts her AirPods in and he's like, there's no way. But looks down and she accidentally turned it to 1.5 speed. Oh my goodness, bless your I don't think the world soul. is ready. <laughs> we already come at 1.5 speed. <laughs> what can I even imagine? Right. Okay, so that was a very awesome mailbag. Appreciate it. You made my day. Next up... We have a an exciting announcement for 2021 CookieCon Orlando. Heather and I may have begged slash been invited to. <laughs> hey, you miss you miss all the shots, shots you, don't, you take. don't take. If you don't ask, the answer is always no. We are just filled with quotes today. I felt like it. It was a good. It's a good Tuesday for quotes. So we're going to be able to do a breakout room with you guys, and we are actually going to be the closing speakers at the final award ceremony, the Sugar Show Awards. Yeah, I can't believe they are letting us speak to you, people. <laughs> <laughs> Please bring your hearing aids. We uh-huh. speak at a decibel level only most dogs can understand. So why I am saying this to you is because if you are on the fence between Dallas Cookie Con this year or Orlando, Dallas is. The dead to us yeah we need your you at orlando cookies for orlando twins for orlando <laughs> i'm gonna find one that works there's something there i see cory at cookie con orlando. but so we actually have never been to cookie con but we spoke to the host mike and karen mike and karen who invited us to possibly have a breakout room where maybe if we ask really nicely yet again, we could film the podcast down there. So a live podcast, and then your questions would be answered live. No hard questions. No hard questions. <laughs> Easy questions. <laughs> you can't edit this if you're asking it in front of us. Um, another reason to choose Orlando is that the room rates are cheaper than Dallas. Ah, see. And so the tickets sell out. They do sell out quickly. You can't buy tickets before June, June 2nd. 2nd. Do you know what? Mike Tamplin posted up in Instagram Live. I actually watched it every I single know. second of that. It was so great. It was actually an hour long, but it's any question you it's ever right. have about CookieCon, I'm going to say it is Kanani's Cookies. On Instagram. She answered everything you could have ever wanted to know about CookieCon, so I'm going to just spell that out for people, because okay. she did such a great job. Yeah, I loved it. I feel like you should go. She even interviewed him. They're on it, too. 
um, K-A-N-A-N-I-S cookies. So Instagram.com forward slash K-A-N-A-N-I-S cookies. Pretty sure most people know her because she has 128,000 followers. But, but if you don't, you if do. you're a cookie con noob, this girl right. just really covered every question you'd ever have. And what me and Heather thought would be fun is if maybe cookie con is not in the cards for you this year, me and Heather would vlog... No, oh, I don't think they're ready for it, but I'm ready for it. We are going to vlog our cookie con journey for you so you can see what it's all about. Um, pros, cons. But at cookie con, it's not cheap. It's not the cheapest place. Compared to the Eddie printer, it is. <laughs> There's that comparison. These three <laughs> Eddie printers. <laughs> um, but each oh, no. ticket is about <laughs> 400 One Eddie printer is three cookie cons. Okay. Okay. You lost me there. Sorry. Math class. <laughs> um, but the cookie con tickets, I think, are 400 three ninety nine. I did my math completely wrong there. Please nobody write in about the math. <laughs> I just did not do correctly. I was just going to glance over like she didn't say anything. <laughs> um, so if you can, we'd love to see you in Orlando. I know you watched the live, though. Tell us a little bit about what you took away. Okay. What I took away from it was it's four days, but it's three action-packed days. And they that have... That is very confusing, what you just said. You get there on one day, and you party hard. <laughs> the next day, you start doing cookies. Right. So it seems like there's two tip ticket types, right? There's the $20 there's vendor 20, show. Yeah. So I heard the vendor show is just amazing. You can shop all your favorite vendors in person. A lot there's of there's a deals. cookie cutter exchange. There was like a cookie cutter exchange table. Like say if you had a dupe on accident, which I have bought on accident, just going crazy on Etsy, I'll like uh. throw something in there. I just got two strawberries. Uh, <laughs> Same day. <laughs> <same day. laughs> so you would put that on there. You buy, you give one, take one. So you would be like, hey, I'm going to give this one. I'm going to pick up this guy because I don't have it. Mm. And that was one thing. There's the sugar show. And then apparently that's a competition and people come and grade oh. what you're doing. Can the vendor ticket take you to some of the breakout rooms? I think the, and don't quote me, I think the vendor ticket allows you to go to the breakout rooms. Okay, we'll just have to ask. Yes. But then, so the the big ticket is $399, right? Not the cheapest thing I've ever heard about, but it seems like... You get to hear from the keynote speakers. Right. Then there's these... Instead of lessening their prices, classes. like we say don't do, they've upped the value. Uh, value, which is great because if you add that much value, people say it's worth it and then some. It must sell out in a couple hours. Yeah. Let me tell you what, if you don't make it on Instagram, this is what she said on her live on Instagram was that on the site at 9 o'clock p.m., June 2nd you were if you're on it and the time turns you're put into this queue crazy and then you get to buy your ticket if you come into the site after nine you're put into the queue in order and mm. then if the tickets sell out you're put on a wait list so they're selling I know I think they said to the Orlando one they're selling 900 tickets right it sounds correct. Right. Something very close to that. So there's a lot of people that want to go, so they must want to go for a reason. And I know it's to hear the twins. Just kidding. <laughs> but don't go to Dallas. <laughs> go, go to, to Orlando. Orlando. <laughs> Because we would love to, to meet some of you in person. I know me and Heather will. You guys are going to be insanely disappointed. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry about that now. Like, this is what you guys look like when you do the, the podcast. <laughs> we'll take a shower. <laughs> so if you have not checked out that live on Instagram, it was very inf- informative. I learned. <laughs> I was going to say that. informational. In- is that the word? D- d- informational. D- 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 informative. <laughs> Anyways, Corey's your boot over there. <laughs> but it's it was very in. in- <laughs> No, it was very I cannot in- let you informative. <laughs> okay, it was informative. It was informational. It was a good live, and there was a lot of nods being spewed around. Learning was had on that <laughs> Instagram live, but anyway, so I'd say it's going to be a blast, and it's September first through the fourth, mm-hmm. and I've already gotten our room tickets because baby get, get shoved in a corner. <laughs> <laughs> can have a bed and a shower. <laughs> but we hope to see some of you there. We'll talk more about it as we learn more about it. So I hope you enjoyed this bonus episode of the Baking It Down podcast. <laughs> 14 more five. <laughs> Bye, guys. <laughs>